What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Bones Breaks. Today we got the brand new product, Allen and Ginter 2020. Looking forward to ripping into this. Uh, in each box, we're going to be guaranteed any of the three following cards. Autograph, relic, um, rip card, or printing plate, or book cards. So it could be any combination of those three. You're not guaranteed an autograph or anything like that. So hopefully we get an autograph. Also, getting a rip card would be super cool, too. They have box topper rip cards, um, which are very rare. And then uh, they also have rip cards in packs. So let's hope that we got a big box topper. And if we did, we have a shot at getting one of those rip cards. So let's see what we got. So we do have the big one. So hopefully it feels thick. It does not. So we do not have... A triple box loader. So let's see what we got for a box loader. Ooh, is that a Luis Robert? This is a Luis Robert box topper. That's pretty sweet. I don't have any like huge uh, <laughs> stands or anything like that. Or any not stands. Any huge penny sleeves. But that's a pretty sweet hit on that Luis Robert. So what do we got in here for packs? I think it's. 24 packs, I believe. So we got some ripping ahead of us. I'm looking forward to it. Looking forward to seeing some of these, uh, seeing some of the hits we can pull out of here. Hopefully we get some good ones. I would really like to get, um, one autograph. Uh, you know, getting, uh, just relics would be kind of, would be kind of lame. But, maybe we'll get some cool ones. So if you guys don't know much about Ginter, it's kind of like a pop culture -y kind of product that baseball puts out. Um, not just baseball cards in here, you'll see a lot of other stuff as well. Nice Jim Tome, Tanaka, Torres, and you're also guaranteed one mini card uh, per pack as well. Johnny Bananas is going to be one of our pop culture guys. Got a Bucky Lassick, that's pretty sweet. On the back here, you can get the regular back, you can get a Allen and Ginter back. Or you can get the Brooklyn back, and the Brooklyn back is one per case, and it's numbered out of 25. Um, the Allen and Ginter back is kind of like a blacker back. I'll show you those guys when we get to that. Also, this little number right here. You can see there's a little number. But the Ginter back, if it's missing one of those, it's pretty rare. So, before we get too much further, let me do the autofocus right there. So then we're not always zoning in and out. So let's keep checking out Ginter. Wade Boggs, Puck, Andy Cohen, Marte. Who are you? Steve Byrne. Steve Byrne, actor, comedian. Ryan Howard. That's our back. Here's that Ginter back of Daryl Strawberry. That's pretty sweet. Pujols, long ball. So we got to do a couple cases of Ginter down at Real Breaks. Pulled some really nice stuff. Christian Yelich autograph. We pulled uh, two rip cards. We got a frame here, that's a good sign. Um, so that could be either an autograph or a relic. I'm gonna save that one. Hopefully it's an auto. Um, we got, uh, we got a, a rip card, we got a couple rip cards and one of the guys that uh, pulled the rip card was nice enough to let me rip it and it was really cool. It was one of the box type of rip cards. We got three, we got three um, stained glasses in there. And Trout Ruth, Babe Ruth that is, and uh, who was the other one? Ichiro was the other um, card that we got. So it was a really good rip card. It was actually Willie Mays rip card. He, he was like, man, it's tough to rip a, uh, a legend like that. But he's glad he did because those stained glasses are super cool. They got a print run of 25 and you can only find them in the box loader rip cards. Let's see what we got here. A little Bregman mini. Blue Appetite. So, like, some of the stuff you can get in Ginter is kind of crazy. Like, I know, like, in the past, they've put, like, presidential hair inside the Ginter cards. Like, they had an Abraham uh, Abraham Lincoln piece of hair. I know they've done that with Kennedy as well. Um, so, it's been pretty good. It's, it's there's some crazy stuff. There's a nice Mike Trout. Bob Feller. Alan Ginter back with CJ Crone. Down on the farm, irrigator. So I don't know how they decide what to put in here. Down on the farm. They also got where monsters live, like going to, going to dark cards. They're pretty cool, actually. 
kind of scary, to be honest with you. Who's Tefet? Stefan Teft. He's a tattoo artist. That's kind of neat. Got a Bob Gibson. JT Relamuto. No rookies yet. Rookies are kind of hard to hit. The checklist for this is huge. It's like 300 card checklist, and they also have a high number checklist as well. And I'm not doing a whole lot of checking for the high numbers, but anything over 300 is a high number. So I think they also have like another like 200 cards. Ooh, that's actually really rare. We have um, the no number on back. So you can see that the Ichiro no number on back. Let me find the other. So you can see the difference. The CJ Crone has the 206. The Ichiro does not have a number on the back. So that's actually a really rare card. You get one or two per hobby box is usually what you get with these. So I'm going to get that one sleeved and top loaded right away because right now that's the hit of the break at the moment. That's a big one. And it's a good name too, get an Ichiro for that. So I'm pretty darn happy with that one. Not a huge fan of the minis, but it's still a really cool card. Let me get focused back up because I had to zoom in a little bit. There you go. So that's a nice hit there. Ichiro, no number on back. So we probably won't be getting another one of those. This kid's from the bird box. Musina, Carmen Killebrew, Ginter, and debut to remember Ross Stripling. Should have another. I guess in each stack we should have a, a relic. So we're on our second stack. So we're a third of the way through. Seeger, little Nolan Ryan, Justin Dunn, rookie. It's our first rookie that we got. Jackie Robinson, Trevor Bauer, Phil Rizzuto. Here's where I was talking about the uh, monsters under the bed. Also the Comcast Tech Tower. Um, but these actually glow in the dark, so you can kind of see how around their hands it's kind of got a little bit raised. So up on top, this will all glow in the dark, and then the hands around the bed will actually glow in the dark as well. So that's kind of neat. They also got like under the stairs in a cave. Uh, where else do monsters live according to them? Do we get another frame? We did get another frame. That's exciting because I'm hoping that at least one of those is going to be an autograph. Hoping for that. Hoping. Doby, Judge, Chapman, Luis Arias, Edmund. That's Sparky. Yep, Sparky Anderson. Got a little casting daddy. Just a normal back. A cow. Don't have a cow. I know some of you guys probably like, just show the autographs. Cow coming up. Don't have a cow, guys. We'll get to them. <laughs> Don Mattingly, Duke Snyder, Robbie Cano. There's Keston again. Jorge Alfaro, Willie McCovey. Got a Ginter back of Ryan Sandberg. And Joe Maurer. Joe Maurer. Great career for that guy. Whitey Ford. We pulled a rip card right. Whitey Ford, too. Ford, Strasburg, Guriel, Bieber, Devers. Trevor Hoffman. Ooh, a little Hank Aaron. With the black parallel on there. That's pretty sweet. Cool. Cool Hank Aaron. And long ball, Mike Trout. Oh, long ball trout. Really excited that we got two framed. Two frames. So this could be either a relic or an auto, which is cool. I've only seen one on card auto so far um, that wasn't framed, and that was a um, Charlie Day. I actually pulled a Charlie Day auto. When I was on a real break, which was really kind of cool. Told my girlfriend about it, and she's like, oh my god, I want, I want that card. I'm like, you actually want to collect cards? She's like, well, Charlie Day, I do. She loves Always Sunny. And then uh, I told her that Chip and Joanna Gaines have an auto on the checklist, too. And she's like, can we get it? I'm like, do you really want it? She's like, that's actually a Lou Brock high number. Um, I'm like, do you actually want it? And she's like, yeah. So I went on eBay, and I looked it up, and... There was only one listed at the time, and they were asking $800 for it. And I said, hey, Rachel, you got 800 bucks to throw around for a chip and run a gains auto? <laughs> She's like, no. I'm like, well. And then she said something I was super proud of. She goes, it's so much more fun to pull them yourself. And I'm like, oh, my God. I knew there was a reason why I loved you. 
<laughs> actually talking about cards about how they're so much more fun to pull yourself instead of just buying them. I'm like, you do listen to me when I talk. <laughs> little Pudge, Rodriguez, Lester, Chapman, Bogarts. Nice. Well, if we don't get anything else, we got a Lou Bob rookie card. That's pretty excellent. Like I said, the rookies are kind of hard to get because the checklist is so big. So getting the Luis Robert is a very nice hit. Very nice hit. There we go. Perfect. So I'm going to a card show this weekend. I'm going to another card show. Actually, it was the same one that I went to last time. But pretty excited. We got a relic coming up here. Pretty excited to get out and get to another card show. See what I can get at the card show this time. We got a Jeff McNeil is our relic. Little Matt Chapman and a Joe Torrey. Jeff McNeil relic. I'm thinking one of those frames is going to be a relic. I'm hoping the other one is an auto. But we won't know until we actually get to see. There we go, little Jeff McNeil. Not bad so far. I got the Lou Bob box topper. Base card. That Ichiro, no number on back, is, is a really big card. A couple more packs to go. Brantley, Stanton, Kakumai, Fotheringham, the wheelchair um, motocross rider. Pretty neat. Stan the Man, Tony La Russa. Got a Trey Mancini, Ginter back. I knew we should be get another one. And a little Babe Ruth. Four packs left. So we did not get a rip card in our Allen and Ginter. But that's okay. Still been a good box so far. We'll drift. Dunst, Gould, Eddie Murray. Got another place where monsters live in the attic this time. So the light coming across, that'll actually glow in the dark then. Judge. Debut to remember. Two packs after this one. Two packs. Then we get to finally see what those autos are. DeGrom, Morgan, Baez, Dahl. That Courtney Hansen? Yep, television host Courtney Hansen. Phil Necro. Got a Howie Kendrick regular back. And... Steinway Tower. Steinway Tower. Two packs. Biggio, Noma, Koufax, Soroka, Charlie Blackman. Be the first to crack the code and win a special 2020 Tops Allen get to Code Breaker autograph. Give her a shot. You never know what could happen. I think you got one per hobby box of those. And Chiso Barrel. Chiso Barrel. Get to learn about some minerals in here, too. Digging deep set checklist. Get to learn about some rocks. Ginter's weird, but Ginter's fun. <laughs> Rizzo, Suarez, Ichiro, Vladdy, Castellanos, Luis Aparicio. I believe he's a high number as well, 348. So Luis Aparicio is also a high number in there. Got a little, is that Lou Gehrig? Yep, Lou Gehrig. Black border. And a combine is also down on the farm. All right, so let's finally see what those relics are. I'm going to, or autographs maybe. Next Solak rookie. Should have a mini stuck to the back. Which is a Lindor. Just a regular back. Marte Olsen. Brianna Scurry. Pedro Kikuchi and... Ooh, Kevin Biggio Auto? Yeah, it is. Cool. Kevin Biggio Auto from Ginter. Nice hit. So I'm thinking the other one is probably going to be a relic then. Well, Kevin Biggio Inc. It's pretty darn sweet. Nice, nice hit. Like I said, it's just nice to get an auto because sometimes you are stuck with just three relics. All right, last one here then. Barrios. So our mini is 
Tom Seaver, rest in peace. Rios, Albies, Ramirez, Nick Ahmed, and Jose Altuve, Bat Relic, is our other hit. So that will do it for Ginter, guys. Not too bad at all. I like the product. It's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Might get another box. I was thinking about it. Get another shot at a rip card, maybe. So yeah, that'll do it for the break. Pretty fun, if you ask me. A little Jose Altuve <coughs> cheater <coughs> relic. Um, Jeff McNeil is our other relic. Pretty nice. It's Kevin Biggio auto as well. Pretty darn cool. And then uh, say the Lou Bob is the next best. Got the Lubob box topper as well. And I think this actually might be the hit of the break here. Ichiro, no number on back. Allen and Ginter back. So a very cool break. Very fun. Um, I'll let you guys know how the uh, card show goes this weekend. Probably going to upload this video on, a, on Friday. I'm ripping this on uh, Thursday at 4 a.m. So I'll let you guys know how the, how the card show goes. And, uh, yeah, we'll see what I pick up. So, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you guys on the next one.